Thank you. Well, good morning. I'm delighted to have President Karzai and President Zadari here at Chequers for our third joint meeting. For the first time, we've brought together the political and the security teams from both Afghanistan and Pakistan for full and frank discussions about how they can work together more closely in the future and how we and the international community can support them in their work. We share the same vision for Afghanistan, a secure, stable, and democratic country that never again becomes a haven for terrorism. And I'm pleased that we're all committed to working together to achieve this, because a stable Afghanistan is in all our interests. Britain is a strong partner of both countries, and we want to see a strong relationship between Afghanistan and Pakistan built on greater trust. Our discussions today have focused on two important issues, the Afghan-led peace process and strengthened cooperation between Pakistan and Afghanistan. And we've made progress on both these issues. We all fully support an Afghan-led peace process and the opening of an office in Doha for negotiations between the Taliban and the High Peace Council. This should lead to a future in which all Afghans, all Afghans, can participate peacefully in that country's political processes. I also want to welcome both presidents' ongoing commitment to strengthen cooperation through the signature of a strategic partnership agreement by the autumn. This should strengthen ties between both countries on economic and security issues, including on trade and border management. Today, we have agreed, frankly, what is an unprecedented level of cooperation. Clearly, there is much more work to be done in the months ahead, and the United Kingdom will continue to stand firmly behind both countries as they work together to bring peace and stability to the region. Finally, the progress we've achieved today sends a very clear message to the Taliban. Now is the time for everyone to participate in a peaceful political process in Afghanistan. Thank you very much, Mr. Prime Minister, <clears throat> once again for providing us uh, a very uh, uh, particular opportunity in this uh, lovely surrounding in Chequers. Uh, to meet uh, between the three of us. The opportunity that you provided, Mr. Prime Minister, was uh, indeed uh, for a very frank and open discussion in which we all discussed our ideas and uh, the vision ahead. Um, I'm glad to note today, Mr. Prime Minister, that we have made progress. I endorse your remarks uh, on the peace process and on the deeper uh, relationship between us and Pakistan and very much hope that all that we discussed today and the subsequent agreements that we made um, will be put into action uh, to the satisfaction of all sides and that um, uh, the Taliban, as you call all of them, will take this opportunity to participate in the peace process so that uh, we in Afghanistan can all participate in building our country's future and that relations between us and Pakistan will subsequently be um, a relationship between uh, two very close, brotherly, and good neighborly countries. Mr. Prime Minister, I thank you once again for your commitment and for providing us this very uh, good and precious opportunity. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you, Mr. Prime Minister, for your support to our both nations, support to the region, and giving us the opportunity to meet here in uh, the beautiful checkers. Once again, Britain comes to our support, as always. You've been very kind. We've had uh, different di dialogues on different issues. We've agreed upon the border management, which is a great issue for both of our nations. Peace in Afghanistan is peace in pa Pakistan. We feel that we can only survive together in a peaceful atmosphere. One can change and have new friends and further relationship with friends. We cannot change our neighborhood or our neighbors. So Afghan brothers have always welcomed us and we've welcomed them. We intend to support them for every step, every uh, field possible. And like uh, the Prime Minister said, we in Pakistan endorses the concept, it's the world uh, peace agenda to have a 
dialogue with the Taliban. We will support it. We will help it and hopefully come out of this um, war, which has been very damaging for both our nations. Thank you. Thank Thank you. Thank you very much for coming.